What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. These are free general collective readings. Caps, caps to decide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply. everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. For all signs, caps to decide. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're 13,160 subscribers. So thanks so much for all the love and support. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys um, from the bottom of my heart chakra. I do. Just saying. Okay. So I received another channeling. I was actually going to do some bonus readings for you guys, and then I got a channeling. So we're going to do it. It's a little heavy. Well, it's a lot heavy, actually. It's a lot heavy. So trigger warning. If you feel this might trigger you, please click off now. Okay? It is heavy. I'm just warning you. Okay? Okay. So, um, the channel message I received was, um, a, um, earth sign, feminine officer of the law. I heard heavy Taurus placements, um, is about to start, uh, receiving very heavy negative karma because of the past. I heard she is about to start getting into severe, severe, violent workplace situations very severe that's all i heard so far i mean that's very broad you have to plug it in how it resonates but some kind of severe violent heavy workplace situations um you plug it in how it resonates um i'll pull some cards and see if we can clarify this but um whoever this person is it's a feminine i heard it's severe heavy karma karma from the past so it's a Taurus, uh, police officer, feminine, uh, well, not Taurus, I'm sorry, excuse me, not a Taurus, it's a earth sign, police officer, earth sign, police officer of the past, fem, earth sign, police officer, there's some kind of heavy negative karma she's about to receive now because of something of the past, sorry, that's confusing me, she's about to receive heavy negative karma upcoming in the universe because of something she did in the past is what I'm presuming from the channel messages. She is an earth sign police officer, Taurus Capricorn Virgo police officer, officer of the law. She has heavy Taurus placements, I heard. So I feel she has at least two or two plus foreign placements in her charts. So Taurus in her either sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, haven, or Jupiter charts. But earth, earth sign, Taurus Capricorn Virgo with heavy Taurus placements. But it sounds like she's about to start receiving this heavy negative karma upcoming in the universe because of something she did in the past if that makes sense um how some kind of severe heavy violent workplace situations it sounds like in her job in her profession as an officer of the law um so it sounds like she's about to come around some very heavy violent situations whatever in the hell they are and how they apply dear god almighty i don't know um, I would never want to be an officer of the law ever, 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 because I know these people, um, deal with very crazy things. I know they do. I respect officers, M men, women, everybody, as long as they are upright in the universe. Um, because I know they do. I know they deal with, um, a lot of heinous situations. I know they do on a daily basis, like on a freaking daily basis. So. Um, I respect upright officers of the law. Absolutely. Absolutely. But, um, whoever this person is, they did something in the past, it sounds like, and now they're about to receive heavy negative karma because of it, um, is what I'm presuming from this. But, um, you, I feel for a lot of you guys, you know, this person, um, uh, and that's why I'm pulling this in. I feel, you know, this person, uh, for some, you might could be this person, but I don't feel you are this person. I feel, you know, this person, um, and you're about to. Uh, maybe you work with them or you are maybe they're a family member or a friend or a community member or etc 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 i'm not sure but it is a feminine officer of the law or sign voice capricorn virgo heavy four emplacements okay let's see Actually, I feel guided to get tea leaves, actually, you guys. I feel guided to get some tea leaves, so I'm going to do that. Shh. 
She's about to see what real neglect, motherly neglect really is. Does not have children. Oh my God, this is terrible. I heard she does not have children and she's about to see what we're, real motherly neglect really is. Um, this is terrible. This is terrible. So she doesn't have children, whoever this poor, um, I do want to say Taurus, but I heard heavy Taurus placements is our sign uh, police officer is, officer of the law. She doesn't have kids. I'm assuming she might be single or in a relationship. I don't know her status, but she definitely doesn't have kids. Um, she's our sign, Taurus Capricorn Virgo with heavy Taurus placements. I keep wanting to say Taurus, but she just has heavy Taurus placements. But she doesn't have kids, and she's about to see what real neglect is. Uh, motherly neglect, I heard. So, um, however that resonates. Um, maybe I feel maybe she wants to be a mother, maybe. Maybe there's a reason I'm pulling this channeling in. So maybe she wants to be a mother, uh, possibly, uh, is what I'm feeling for some of these, possibly. About to witness some serious rough visuals of children, truly neglected and abused children. It's about to open her eyes in a huge way. Oh my God, this is terrible. Her, she's about to witness some serious neglect, um, some serious visuals of true neglected children, neglected and abused children. It's about to really open her eyes in a huge way. I think this person wants to be a mother is what I'm feeling. I'm serious. There's a reason I'm pulling these challenges in. I think she wants to be a mom. Spirit messages you have reflected. I'm, ser I, I'm serious. There's a reason I'm pulling this in. I think she thought you maybe you maybe she thought you was a bad mom in the past or somebody you're connected to was a bad mom in the past hold on a second i need to shut the window my neighbor is mowing his grass hold on one second i apologize okay i apologize um hopefully y'all can hear me okay um, yeah, I think she thought you were about, maybe she accused you of being a bad mom in the past, or she thought you were a bad mom in the past, or something, or something of that nature, or somebody you're connected to, but however that resonates, I think maybe she wants to be a mom or something. There's a reason I'm pulling this in, but her, she's about to see what true abuse of a child or children and true neglect of a child or children looks like in 3D visuals. So she's about to see it with her own eyeballs out in the universe soon this hasn't happened yet it sounds like it's upcoming in the universe um soon soon and it is about to traumatize the hell out of her she's about to have serious regret soon oh my god i heard soon and it's about to traumatize the hell out of her she's about to have se severe regret soon oh my god this is terrible you plug it in how it resonates so it sounds like she's about to um in her job career field, which she is an officer of the law, so a police officer, um, she's about to see some truly abused child or children and truly neglected child or children. Um, and she's about to seriously regret the past in some shape, form, or fashion. I think for some, she might she might have accused you of neglecting your child or children or something of that nature. I'm not saying she did, but there's a reason she's about to receive this negative karma is what I'm trying to say. And it's about to be in her workplace. Um, she's about, I heard she's about to have serious regret of the past. So she, whatever that regret of the past is for her, only she knows her story, not anybody else. There's a reason I'm pulling this lady in, um, whoever this person is. Spirit messages you have repeated. One of these children will be almost on their deathbed by the time they, they are found. Oh my God, this is terrible. I heard one of these children will almost be on their deathbed by the time they are found. So it sounds like she's going to be on call or calls to abuse or truly abuse and neglected children. This is not, 
people, kids that are not, I mean, truly abused and neglected children. I heard one of these children will be almost on their deathbed by the time they are found. So, I mean, my God, this is terrible. Terrible. So, I mean, a child about to be on their deathbed, either from neglect or abuse. But it sounds like this earth sign thin police officer of the law is going to be on this call or calls when this is occurring. Maybe she finds his child, possibly. Or one of her partner or partners does. How that resonates. But she either is going to hear about it or she's going to, well, I heard visual. So I think she's actually going to see it. I think she's actually going to see it with her own eyeballs is what I think. Oh my gosh, this is terrible. Spirit messages you have like this. This is terrible. I think she's stubborn. It's taking me forever to get these cards out. Or the abu uh, abusive parent or parents are obviously stubborn, not getting their children help. I'll tell you that. She might either be stubborn or, or the damn abusive child, uh, parents are. Definitely the abusive parents or neglectful parents. I heard neglect and abuse. So, I mean, there's a child about to be on their deathbed. I don't know if it's about to be from neglect or uh, abuse or both. Neglect, I'm thinking they might have left child or children in the home by themselves, unsupervised for like two days, three days, four days, five days. Hell, I've seen a news link before. Uh, somebody um, left a child in their home like a week, and the child was like four years old or five years old for like a week while they went on vacation in a different country. This was like six or seven months ago or something like that, but and this was like in New Jersey or something, but that's fucking crazy. That's crazy. I feel bad I get one more. We have work achievement, success, and great passion. I think she cares. I'm not I'm not downing this officer of the law. I'm not. But I will tell you she's about to receive some very heavy negative karma. These serious events about to come up is about to make her do something she never thought she would do and quickly. It is about to traumatize the hell out of her. Oh my God, I heard these serious events about to come up. It's about to make her do something she never thought she would do. And quickly, it's about to traumatize the hell out of her. So I think she has heart. I'm, I'm not downing this officer of the law, but she did make some kind of mistake or mistakes in the past. Everybody makes mistakes, but whatever the hell is about to happen, it is about to traumatize her. And it's about to be in her workspace regarding child or children. I'll tell you that. Truly abused and neglected children, not abused and neglected children people are claiming, and they're not abused or neglected. These are truly abused, neglected, and abused children. Like, one is about to be on their deathbed. Like, I think they're going to, I mean, they're going to need immediate medical assistance kind of energy. I mean, seriously. So I'm not downing her. I think she cares. I think she has passion uh, for her work. Or whatever, um, something's going to make her... Um, do something very soon and quickly she never thought she would do. Maybe it's call, call emergency medical services, possibly. Or something else. I don't know. I feel got to get one more. We have work achievement, success, and great passion. Spirit messages you have to play this. Her eyes are about to grow up. Uh, are about to get wide open soon. About to grow up in a huge way. Her eyes are about to get wide open in a huge way. About to grow, grow up in a huge way. Younger earth sign feminine. Younger earth sign femme. So she's a younger earth sign femme with heavy force placements. Female. Officer law. So she's 35 or below I'm feeling. Um, she's about to grow up in a huge way. She's about to be on call or calls regarding neglected or abused children soon. And I'm just being real. I'm pulling her in so strong. Um, she might watch my channel or somebody connected to her might watch my channel. I feel a lot of you guys, you might know her. Um, and I'm just serious. There's a reason I'm pulling her in. Um, I think she cares about child or children. I just think she had a distorted viewpoint of something in the past. Um, but she, now, soon, it's, well, not now, but soon, upcoming in the universe, she's about to really see what abused and neglected children really look like, I'm assuming, in 3D. 
this is terrible. I would never, I, that's terrible. Being a nurse is hard enough. I would hate having to be an officer of the law and having to walk in on a child that has been neglected or abused and on near on their damn deathbed and having to get them, get them some assistance because you know they've been so abused or neglected. And I'm serious. This is terrible. I heard it's about to grow her up in a huge way. So I think she's immature um, or has acted immature about person, people, place, or situation in the past. It's exactly what I think. Very immature, but she's about to grow the hell up quickly. Very immature, about to grow the hell up quickly. And I heard one of the channel messages in here earlier that there was some kind of violent workplace situations before we heard about the abuse and the neglect. So I think the violence is regarding some kind of abuse of children. And I'm serious. Like, I think physical. Somebody is about to put hands on two children. Like, I feel, I feel. Our violent workplace situations. And we're pulling children with abuse and neglect. Um, God, this is crazy. Spirit message is here. Like this. It is about to tear apart this earth sign feminine's relationship with the Libra in a huge way. It is about to tear apart this earth sign fem's relationship with the Libra in a huge way is what I heard. So um, I guess all these workplace experiences upcoming in the universe she's about to have with abused and neglected children, like I heard visuals, so she's, I think she's going to see it with her own eyeballs. Um, in her community, in her city, in her town, in her province, etc., etc., etc. She has some kind of relationship with the Libra in some shape, form, or fashion. I didn't hear if it was a masculine or femme Libra, only she knows who this Libra is, um, not anybody else. But she has some kind of relationship with the Libra, whether it's platonic, romantic, or what have you, what have you. But somehow it's going to tear apart the relationship with the Libra because it's going to grow her ass up when she sees all these abused and truly abused and neglected children. On these caller calls is what I'm feeling. This is terrible. I heard in, I told y'all in here earlier I thought somebody was stubborn. I think this might be the abuser or neglect person she's about to come across. For some it could be her because I heard she was very immature or she is very immature but basically this is about to grow her up. So I think she's stubborn. I think she's currently stubborn. She's done looks currently immature. And she doesn't really understand what true abuse and neglect of child or children is. But she's about to learn what it is, basically, is what I'm feeling in here. And I'm just being for real. I, I'm serious. Whoever this um, earth sign, officer of the law is, femme earth sign, with heavy Taurus placements. And she has some kind of relationship with the Libra, whoever this is. But after all this occurs, I heard it's going to tear apart the relationship between her and this Libra. Now, I don't know if the Libra is a co-worker, a lover, a neighbor, a family member, a friend, etc., etc., etc. But she is definitely connected to a Libra in energy. And it's about to tear the relationship apart in some shape, form, or fashion. For some, I feel like they could be co-workers because we have work, achievement, and success. Possibly for some. Lord. These are going to be very horrific events. Very horrific. It is about to grow her ass up in a huge way. And there's about to be a lot of them soon. In her area. These are about to be very horrific uh, events soon. Very horrific. Um, it's about to grow her ass up in a huge way, and there's about to be a lot of them in her area soon. So I'm assuming her ju jurisdiction, her area, you know, she's officer law. So, you know, in her jurisdiction, wherever she works, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, um, there's about to be a lot of them soon. 
It's about to grow her up in a huge way. I think she misjudged somebody in the past. Whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. I think she misjudged somebody or misjudged a situation. But basically, she's about to really see what abuse and neglect really is. Um, in her workplace, because she's an officer of the law. Um, it's about to grow her up in a huge way. Wow, man. Great passion. She will end up getting her honor for this. She will end up getting high honor for this. Well, that's good. So she's going to do something in her workplace regarding these abused or neglect. I heard there's about to be a lot of them soon in her jurisdiction, in her area. So, I mean, it sounds like when she's on call on her shift, because um, she's an officer of law, I feel she, I don't feel she works at a school. I mean, I'm just serious. She don't work at a school. I don't think this is school related. This is like call related. I think she works like out in the community somewhere. Uh, I heard in her area. So I think she works out in a jurisdiction area in her area. Uh, I don't feel she works at a school. I don't feel she goes around public speeds. None of that. Like she's a foot officer. I don't feel she's traffic or anything like that. Um, is what I feel. I mean, I don't know, but I do know she's about to come across a lot of abused and neglected children. I'll tell you that. And I don't feel this is on the traffic stop. I'll tell you that. Um, I heard she is going to get her honor, so that's good. I like, I told y'all earlier, I think she cares. I just, but uh, we also heard she was very immature. So she had a clouded perception of something regarding some situation of the past. And I think it, I think it was regarding child or children. But her viewpoint, I think, is about to change in a huge way. Um, we heard in here she didn't have kids, too. So um, I think that probably has something to do with it, too. Um, but the viewpoint's about to change when she sees these real, in her own eyeballs, in the 3D, a really abused and neglected children. And I heard a lot of situations are about to come up soon. So I feel she's about to be on a lot of these calls soon. Um, and it's about to, I heard it's about to happen soon. So I mean, and she's going to get her honor. So she's going to do something to help save child or children or something i didn't well i didn't hear she was going to save them but i feel she's going to get honored regarding something regarding these caller calls is what i'm feeling the abused or neglected child or children calls um i feel these might be um i wonder if this is like domestic violence or calls or something but it's it's heavy children i'll tell you that this is terrible but she is going to get her honor And through many series of chain events, she's going to make a very important phone call to a very important, influential person in her city and tell the truth on the past. And it's going to get another person high honor. Wow, okay. Well, so she doesn't sound like a low vibrational person. She just was very immature. Sounds like she's about to grow up, which is good. I mean, because this sounds upcoming in the universe. This doesn't sound like it happened yet. But I heard once all this occurs, she's going to get high honor. And once she gets high honor, she's going to make a very important phone call to somebody very influential. I heard in her city soon. And it's going to get another person high honor. So she has great passion for her um, her profession, which is an officer of the law. And good, I'm glad she does. But she had also had an altered perception about something of the past. Whatever the hell it was. Um, I think it re was regarding child or children. And I'm serious about that. But um, that's just my thoughts on that. But whatever it was, only she knows what she's going to make the very important phone call about, not anybody else. But she's going to end up getting high on her in one of these situations, or two or two plus. And I heard after this, she's going to make a very important phone call to somebody in, uh, influential, very highly influential in her city. And she's going, and that's, it sounds like that phone call is going to get um, give somebody else high honor. A mother that truly deserves it. She's about to have a huge wake-up call and realize this. 
Okay, I heard a mother that truly deserves it. She's about to have, it, have a huge wake-up call and realize this. So she has great passion. She, I don't, I don't think her heart was in the wrong place. Um, I just think she had a distorted view of situation or situations. It sounds like she's going to make it right. Great passion. I mean, I'm serious. So that, I mean, that's not bad. I do think she's stubborn. I'll tell you that. Um, hopefully not aggressive. I don't think she's aggressive. I think she was stubborn about situation in the past, but she's about to really see truly, truly see truly aggressive and de like domestic violence, true neglect, true abuse of children. Like I heard one of these situations is going to be a child near on their damn deathbed. I mean, like not like call 911 right freaking now. They are, their, their respirations are about to go out. Their pulse is about to go out. They are about to fucking just be like a sisterly. Like, boom. That's what I'm feeling. Very, very, very violent situations with children. Very violent. These children are going to be in huge, 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 huge trouble. Problems. Mentally and physically. Oh, dear God. Woo! You plug it in how it resonates. So it sounds like she's about to come across... Um, some truly abused kids. And I mean, I hate talking about this on here, but this is what I'm pulling in in the energetic space. Somebody really is about to go through this. Uh, pull, um, well, I keep saying Taurus, but I heard Earth sign with heavy Taurus placements. This younger, 35 or below, I'm feeling, Earth sign, them, police officer, officer of the law, heavy Taurus placements with no kids, whoever she is. Um, very immature, but about to grow the hell up. Very, I heard she's about to come across very, very, very abused children. Very abused. Uh, physical, they're, I heard they're going to need serious physical care and mental care. So, I mean, they're going to need physical, medical treatment and mental health treatment because they're about to be beat up so bad, basically, from a stubborn, aggressive person or people. I don't, I don't think from the, this officer. I think from the calls she's about to embark on is what I'm feeling. Um, this is, whoa, God. I didn't hear anything else. I didn't hear anything else. I was waiting to see if I did. Many, 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 many shocking series of time events are about to ha happen with these situations soon. They're about to come soon and quickly, soon and quickly. Many, many, many shocking series of time events are about to come with these situations soon. They're about to happen soon and quickly, soon and quickly. So a lot of abuse situations and a lot of neglect situations I'm feeling with in her workplace with these children. Um, and I think she's going to be a part of this. But I heard she's going to end up getting high on her. So it sounds like she's going to handle it in an appropriate fashion and situation. I mean, she's going to handle it in an appropriate fashion. Um, and she's going to end up getting uh, giving another mother high on her um, after some of this or all of this or what have you. I'm not sure. But only she knows the action she's going to take, not anybody else. But she's about to grow the hell up, I'll tell you that. She's about to grow the hell up. Whoever this person is. Uh, and it's good. I think her heart's in the right place. I just think she had a distorted view of situation or situations in the past. But she's about to, I think, gain some clarity. About to gain some serious clarity. 
about to gain some serious clarity, I heard. Some serious clarity. Okay, so she's about to gain some serious clarity. Okay, I'm ending it. We're at 30 minutes. We're ending it. All right, you guys. I hope this helped. Um, I think you guys know this person is what I think. Maybe for some, you could be this person. I'm not downing you, person, officer, of them, officer of the law. I just want to let you know. I'm not downing you, ma'am. Um, it just sounded like you had some life lessons to learn, but you're about to learn them through your workspace. I'll tell you that right now. Uh, but I heard you're going to end up getting high honor. You have great passion for your job, and that's good. Um, I hope you help save some child or children. Uh, hashtag save the kids. Um, I, absolutely. I think I'm going to title it hashtag save the kids. Um, because it sounds like you're about to be a hero in this. And um, I was, my hat's off to you. I can never, well, I, I can't say I can never be an officer. Because, I mean, I'm too old to be a damn police officer. That's just the truth. I'm 38. I'm too damn old. Um, but I would never want to be. I would never want to be um, because I would just break my damn heart. It, I would never want to be a peds nurse because I'm a nurse. For anybody doesn't know, I'm a nurse. RN. Been RN since 2013. I would never want to be a peds nurse because of this. And I've dealt with peds patients before when I worked um, in public health, uh, just giving vaccinations. And that was heartbreaking enough. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Love you guys. Namaste.